you go. Right, so Phil yeah. is the road sweeper and he's going to give it a run up and down the road now so we can perhaps go over to video. Oh, look at that coming down. It's a beastie. It is a beastie. See if we can get a video of him running up and down and operating his... Uh, I'm talking between the devil and the deep blue sea now. I don't know if I want to record. Phil, it'll take his... me a couple of minutes anyway to build air up. So. Oh, you've got to build air up? You've got an air leak? <laughs> they all have. They all have. There's that much stuff that works on air, the old little pipes. Right, I'm going, I'm going to video this and I have no idea what it is. Oh, that is a massive piece of kick. I do not have a clue what it is. And we're off, are we? down at the front look, scrubbing and then suction. You know, when you're driving it really annoys you when you get stuck behind these things, but, you know, on the other hand, uh, they are essential bits of kit. I bet you're exhausted after that, aren't you? Must be time for another cup of tea, yeah? Uh, time for another cup of tea. <laughs> yeah, you got to be careful you don't spill it, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. Can't drink and drive. Well, no, I know you can. <laughs> so, if I want to try and get on site, do I need to speak to? Any idea? Um, there might be a chap that can help you where that blue car is there. Right. There's a cabin behind there, he might be able to help you. And if I go in there, is he going to tell me to piss off? Uh, if it's the younger, smaller chap, I don't think so. But the, the other chap's fairly understanding. I mean, if, if he can help you, he will, but... Yeah. If, if he... Mind you, I've been told to piss off before now, haven't yeah. you? <laughs> so have I. Yeah, yeah, many occasions. Yeah. You don't see many of them all-terrain fork trucks. They tend to use telehandlers, don't they? Yeah, they do now, yeah. Yeah, what's your channel called, by the way? PJ Audits. PJ Audits. PJ, as in, I've put my PJs on at night. And then Audits, A-U-D-I-T-S. I see your pens are about as good as mine. Because I get covered in dust. You are, sorry? They get covered in dust. That dust just... All right, yeah, that buggers them up. Have you tried licking them on end? Not often. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's somebody coming down in the motor now. I wonder if I can have a word with... Oh, now he's got some top back. Let's have a look what he's got back of here. Oh, I don't know what that is. That is a tarmac machine. It's a tarmac machine. I'm glad you know what it is, Phil. Right, oh, is this classed as plant? It is. So do you run it on red diesel? No, because it goes on the road. Right. The donkey engine, it's got two engines, it's got road yes. engine, and the donkey white diesel, engine. donkey engine runs on red. Right. But we do, we do have one that's permanently on another side that runs completely on red. It, you got one that's on another side at what? It's completely on red, the donkey and the road engine. Right. it never goes on road. Never goes on road. Yeah. yeah. It's like uh, Lois had got fridges on back, run the fridges off of red. Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, some of these, were, you know, with the um, with the tanks on the back where they have to blow off, they can yeah. run the donkey engines on red. Yeah. Um, right, I'm going to move on now then. I'm going to go and have a word in office and see yeah. if they tell me to bugger off. Right. And uh, if they don't, I shall be back. But I'm going to keep coming back anyway. And, uh, Do you want to borrow my hard hat so you can have a wander around? And... I've got one in car. All right, fair uh, enough. I've got my steel boats on and I've, yeah. you got know... more equipment than all. Yeah, yeah, I always come equipped, mate. Yeah. The only thing I ain't got is tea-making equipment. <laughs> so you can have a wander about at night? Oh, well, I've got, I've got a McDonald's uh, coffee in car. Right. And the thing about McDonald's, their cups keep the coffee warm for ages and ages. Yeah. Yeah. And it's cheaper than Starbucks up the road, which is extremely yeah. expensive. Boss, boss went up there for one. You what, sorry? Boss went up, up there for one. He didn't get much change out of four quid. No, you ain't there. Now, he looks like somebody I could talk to, but he's disappearing again. And I'm not very good at this because I've, I've changed my camera setup and it, it keeps not recording when I think it's recording. So mm -hmm. well, it's good how it's balanced. Yeah, yeah, it's a, it's a good old gimbal that. But I've changed the software on my phone. Yeah. 
and that's my problem. So, do you have to maintain this then? Um, I can change, I can change brushes, but that's about it. I can do little mechanical jobs, replace hoses and things like that. But they don't pay you enough for that. It's another thing. I, I am capable, but it's whether you've got all bits. I mean, we do carry a few spares, but it's stuff that you know that wears out quicker than others. So is that your red diesel tank there? That one is, yeah. Yeah, that's for your donkey engine then. That is, yeah. And then you've got one on the other side for your for your white diesel foot road engine. It's actually under under the body at the back. Of the Will you take a bit of filling then? You have to kneel down. You have to kneel down. You have to kneel down for it for a little. I've had wives like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not getting into that conversation. No. <laughs> so how much water can this carry then? I'm not quite sure. You just fill it up until it's full. I just fill it up until it starts coming back out, and then, and then that's it, runs, it. When it runs out, I fill it back up again. All right. So, so what do you do with all the shit that's in back then? Uh, I will designate an area for you to tip that goes to um, it's classed as contaminated waste. So they have to they have to put it in a certain area, and then they'll take it all away together. Right. When things are nearly done. But you don't know what they do with it, and you don't care. It goes in a tipper somewhere. Oh, does somewhere it? Somewhere else, yeah. Yeah. As far as I know. Yeah. They can't bury it, they're not allowed to. No. No. Yeah, you're only allowed to... Do certain things with it. To, yeah, to tip in specific areas. Yeah. Right, I'm going to go and have a word in the office then, That's while fine. you uh, continue with your cup of coffee. No, I'm just going to have a walk around. You're going to have a walk around? Just check your pocket. There's a lot of traffic in and out of here, isn't there? The news. Phone numbers? Yeah. yeah. So, uh. Just been I'm... watching some of the stuff. You are, sorry? Just been reading some of the titles and some of the stuff that people. Why, be, why get aggressive? Oh, why yeah, some travel? of them do, yeah, yeah. Some of them get their really asses on. <laughs> they really do. Right, anyway, I'm gonna move on because I'm gonna go and. Have a look at some in Doncaster. I want to go and have a look at. Um... You get about a bit, but don't you, Southampton? They're all over. Oh yeah, like dog shit, mate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all over the place. Uh, well, it's not anymore. They pick it up and take it down, don't they? Oh yeah. Uh, well, some, a lot of people do. Yeah, a lot of people do. Yeah, not like when we were kids. You had to be careful playing football on grass because it dog shit. Yeah, I'll pick it up on the end of a stick and chase your mates around with it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> that were entertainment when I was a kid. <laughs> yeah, you didn't have Game Boys and things like that, did you? You used to have a piece of shit on the end of a stick. <laughs> or in a bag. Or in a bag, uh... Get it on the end of a stick and then flick it. <laughs> ah, disgusting, never mind. Yeah, I'm going to go into Doncaster. There's one or two places I want to have a look at there. Well, the best, yes. Well, you'll be catching yourself on YouTube in a bit. Right, hopefully, yeah. All right, Let's so do you want to say hi to anybody while you're there? You've got, thir what is it, they say, you've, you've got, got 30, you've seconds, got 30 to seconds to say hello. To say hello to your friends and family. Yeah, my uh, wife Ruth, my three kids, Rosie, Emily and Luke, uh, Ben and James and anybody else that knows me. Anybody else that knows me, <laughs> there you go. Right, I'm going to catch you later. Are you right. down here regular? Uh, hopefully, yeah. All right, well, I might see you again if I come back in a week or so and yeah. see how things have changed. I might build some of them, All right, mate, look after yourself and anyway. You. Cheers. All, All the best. best. You take care, don't get me. And you. <laughs> don't get caught, and if you do, don't give me details. Yeah.